Hello family. Welcome back to another episode from Walk Africa Fun Facts. If you're not yet subscribed, the membership is just a subscription away. Welcome on board and let's walk Africa to know Africa. In today's video, we shall focus on top hydroelectric power plants in Kenya together with the power it yields. We shall also analyze and comment on the reservoirs behind each dam together with their economic significance. Number 7. Sangoro Hydroelectric Power Station. This is found in Kisumu County along River Sondu Merio. The year of commissioning of this dam was 2013 and the power capacity of the dam was 20.2 megawatts. The cost of construction of this dam was 78 million US dollars. Number 6. Masinga Hydroelectric Power Station. This station is found in Embu, Machakos County and the River Stana. The year of commissioning of this dam was 1981. The power capacity of the dam is 40 megawatts. The cost of construction of this dam was 172 million US dollars. Masinga Reservoir holds water for other hydroelectric power stations downstream of Tana River. She is a member of the seven folk dams of Kenya. Number 5. Kindaruma Hydroelectric Power Station. This is found in Mbukitoi County and the River Istana. The year of commissioning of this dam was 1968 and a recent upgrade in 2012. The power capacity of this dam is 72 megawatts. She is also a member of the Seven Folk Dam of Kenya. Number 4. Kamburu Power Station. She is found in Mbukitui counties and the river Istana. She was commissioned in 1974 with a power capacity of 93 megawatts. She costs Kenya 47 million US dollars to construct. She is also a member of the seven folk dams of Kenya. Number 3. The Tukwell Power Station. This is found in West Pokot County along River Tukwell. She was commissioned in 1981 with a power capacity of 106 megawatts. Other purposes of this dam include fishing and irrigation activities. Number 2. Kiambere Hydroelectric Power Station. She is found in Mbukitui counties along River Tana. She was commissioned in 1987 with a power capacity of 165 megawatts. She cost Kenya 95 million US dollars to construct. Kiambere is also a member of the Seven Folk Dam system of Kenya. Number 1. Kitaru, Kitaru Hydroelectric Power Station. This is found in Embu Machakos counties along River Tana. She was also commissioned in 1978. The power capacity of this dam is 225 megawatts, and this is the highest we have so far in Kenya. Kenya's hydroelectric potential is only partially tapped, and it is expected by 2030. Kenyans' uh, hydroelectric power potential will increase from the current 800 megawatts to uh, figure around 1,100 megawatts, accounting for only 5% the power capacity of, can, uh, of Kenya by that time. Kenya is also continuously prospecting for renewable energy. That is it for today. We take a bite of our continent a day at a time. Be sure to subscribe for more updates. Until next time and the next episode, bye and take care.